why am I playing this? Hello everybody. Welcome to... Welcome, welcome to Amnesia. I, I have the collection. Go play and be every single one to prove that I'm not a whiny little bitch, which I am because I'm scared. Uh, for those who know, which is nobody, uh, there was this one game. It was free. It was off Kickbox Gold. Honestly, it wasn't even that good. Um, I tried on I think three or four separate occasions to play it, and every single time at around 20 minutes in, I quit because I was so incredibly scared. <laughs> and it wasn't even that scary of a game, like from like a third person perspective, you know, me playing it. It's, it wasn't, and it's scary. So Amnesia, one of the most infamous of horror games, Dark Descent, first one, 2011. I think it's been, it was like retouched or whatever. I don't know. Frictional games. Oh wow, that is an old screen. <laughs> That's like the most modern logo I've seen here. <laughs> okay, press A. Oh, why am, why, am I going through like, a bottle? What do I do? Okay, pick my account. Okay, that possible experience. Oh wow, yeah. Leisure should not be played to win. Set focus on immersing yourself in the game's world and story. Not worry about when. I don't like the fact that I'm like going through a urethra here. <laughs> about when and how it is to save during gameplay. The game will take care of that for you. When you want to leave the game and just choose save and exit, you can then use continue to return to where you left off next time you start the game. Can you tell this was from 2011? <laughs> They like have to teach you all the very basic of basic stuff. Get in your place and you're extremely vulnerable. Do not try to fight the enemies in counter. Instead, use your wits, hide, or even run if necessary. The air play between light and gun because of this is vital to set up the gamma correctly. Use the slider below to adjust so the square to right is barely visible. That is all. Hope you enjoy immersing yourself in the world of amnesia. I played one Amnesia game in the past, and it was very buggy and very bad. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at that. Uh, subtitles, show hints, show death hints, shows crosshair. Good graphics, input, oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, 2011, this would have been before Xbox One, since that was 2013. So the Xbox 360 days. Sheesh. Oh my, look at that HUD! <laughs> the, the words don't even match, Christ, okay. A game, I, a game was meant to be played, or enemies was playing more easily, tinder boxes are normal or harder to come by, all I'll save is to sale, and saving your game costs tinder boxes, losing your sanity will kill you. Start a new game. I mean, not. I don't think it really aged don't well forget. in terms of the hut. Some things mustn't be forgotten. The shadow hunting me. I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at, at uh, Mayfair. What have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is... Damn, it seems like he's forgetting amnesia. Wow. <laughs> Damn. Alright, I'm Daniel. I live in Mayfair. British. Sadly. Seems like something hit me on my head. Generally, most common way I can get amnesia. Uh, All the liquid trail and find the source. Notes are available. Okay. 
My name is Daniel. Whoa. I don't like how slow this is making. Oh. Oh. Uh. Uh. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's, it literally was just the wind. It was just the wind. God damn it. Right. Hold down right trigger and use the right stick in order to move the door. Okay, so you can like peek around corners. That's. I don't like the fact that that's an option. My feet are like echoing, which is making it sound like there's like a set of feet chasing me or something. Excuse me? Oh my god. Okay. Uh. Please, no. Don't. Oh, look at these. Look at these bricks. Oh, those are cool bricks. I don't like that. Forcing me to walk. I don't think there's any like run or sprint mechanic. Old archives. Door slammed shut behind him, and he knew he would never again see his old tailor at Berkeley Square. Another lone soul in London seemed appropriate somehow. Oh, that's. <laughs> Yo, I'm on four right now. I'm a, a bit. I'm wanna hop on. I mean, I <laughs> I got this game. Set up. I mean, I've been wanting it. I've had this in my library for a while. I don't want to stream it. I mean, you can go. You're not obligated to stay here. Don't worry. <laughs> so you throw it. Press. Look at it from different angles. Ooh. Yee. This is better rotational mechanics than Skyrim. Oh. Uh. Excuse me. Stand to slowly drain, turn lights are in the environment, or use different boxes of search for. Oh, this is a source of light. Right? Oh, hi! Rats! This is a source of light. This should save off any damage. Oh my god. Oh, what the hell. Uh, I don't like it when it takes the control of the camera away from me. Okay. Uh, I'm guessing... Oh yeah. So, I don't want to use all of that. Added no being sexual in the chat cause me. <laughs> <laughs> no, I would never. I don't know why you would possibly say that. Ah, uh, holy! Sh stop it! Why? I probably have a concussion. I got beaten up once for my sexuality. For spring break. And. Alright. Don't shit yourself. No promises. Um. 19th of August, 1839. Oh. I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there will be anything left after I consume this drink. Don't be afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a I was trying to talk, you Daniel. God. Effort to put things right. God willing, Daniel's the name stupid. Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. 
Go to the inner sanctum, find Alexander, and kill him. His body is old and weak, and yours, young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last thing. A shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare, breaking down Can't reality. Wait to talk again. <laughs> I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Yeah, Redeem that's the one image I have in my Daniel. head. Descend what into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. Your former self, Daniel. Okay, uh, I'm gonna pause. Uh, as, as I was saying, actually, no. I have a goal. Oh, okay, I'm just back. Alright, my controller died. I was hoping it would turn off at some pivotal moment and that would lead to some content. It didn't. It was just an annoyance. Take this broom. Shove it in this fire. Haha. -ha. Arson. Um. That was it. Right, beating up. Um. When I got beat up, I got a black eye and a concussion. Uh, and when I had the concussion, you know, everything was like louder, and my movements felt weird, and I didn't know where to go, even if there were like super obvious instructions, right? Like, uh, go to your, uh, go upstairs to your room. I would be like, huh? Even though I, you know, went to my room, I sleep there, I spend most of my time here. Alexander, is it inside the castle? In a manner of speaking, come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennan. Excuse me? Stuff implying it can't be torn by hand or tools. Can I burn it? Walking the door, why can't I burn it? There's a perfectly good torch here. Yeah, but it was it's very hard to explain. It was like an experience like no other. So, you know, I I mean it at the very least made it very accurate at how it felt. I'm guessing that's what is going on. Cella Fenaria. Where am I going? Can it be dissolved? I don't freaking know. I 
I was wondering if I could burn it. Guess I'll go to the laboratorium. Maybe it has some acid. I'd like some acid right about now. Maybe I'd, I'd ha make it this. It'll probably make this worse. For legal reasons, <laughs> that is a joke. I have not had acid. I don't know why I like stopped doing that. This stream is probably getting flagged for this though. <laughs> Oh, kitchen floor. Tears were beginning to swell in his eyes. He received his first nick kick at his tongue. Case of Romantic and Fear Shoes, he will be finished. He fell to the kitchen floor. Wait, is that an epic Will Wood reference? I'm down pounding my head against the kitchen floor. Apologizing for my life and never bring yours. Say I'm sorry, but this can't go on. I know you've got scars of your own, but have my life before you go. I don't live or die alone. Uh, 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 uh. Man, shut up. God damn. I think those are supposed to be very scared clothes or just dead people. Ah. There should be more coop rats. Oh cool. Let me see them here. And one part aqua force. Aqua Force, is that what I'm supposed to be getting? I heard footsteps. I do not like the sound of that. This is my third attempt to produce artificial vitae. Former compounds lack the potency I need, but I sense I'm close. Calamine and orpiment or or are given, and the cupric binds them well. This time, I will attempt aqua regia instead of aqua fortis, and hope it will produce a more even solution. The experiment was unsuccessful. The solution is highly acid, uh, highly acidic, <laughs> and proves impractical to put any use except as a detergent. Organic tissue reacts especially violently to the solution. It should be handled with grace care. I'd be able to use a recipe, but I'm losing hope that I will find an alchemic solution to my predicament. Uh, okay, that's worrying. Wasn't for the thought of you, my love, I wouldn't be able to go on. And I find myself doing terrible things, I take comfort in you. As long as I am able to think of you and long for a life together, I know I'm better than the others. I wait for them, and they lust for power without restraint, where I only crave fair judgment and a safe return. That is. Oh, okay. So that's just a little goober? Alright. Ooh, another note. Chemical relocation. The lack of a chimney to properly vent the fumes from my most recent experiments is taking a soul in many of my less stable ingredients storage. Some seem unaffected, but many are stained by the fumes and will be difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can and move them to the wine cellar. Oh, cool. Four different chemicals are needed to continue. Um, Night. 
and you need to find an oil potion. Why is this so shaky? That wasn't me walking. Just go up the stairs. Don't. Can you quickly go? Here, this is light. Fragrant taste of rose lingered in his mouth. Turkish delights, he thought, just like the ones at the consulate. Constantinople. Oh, that gives us a time for this. Back to Constantinople. No, you can't go back to Constantinople. No, it's Istanbul. No, Constantinople. Been a long time gone. Constantinople. It works. By the key or launch cellar, evidence in the laboratory reveal the combining of work and goals, some sort of organic tissue. Okay. I hope those are rose petals. This reminds me of uh, your first Resident Evil game. Like a staircase like this. Alright, won't well, budge. Well, at least we know it's daytime outside. Cabularium. Well, that's boarded up, so I can't. Archives. Traveling to Dover and going through Canterbury. Made sure to pay a visit to avoid the sense of guilt connected with the neglect of the family. So are these like screens supposed to be like, oh, over time you're gonna piece together who he was? In that case, that's actually really cool. Sixteenth of May, eighteen thirty-nine. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness. Later that evening, we are up tomorrow. I shall lead men into the ancients. Uh. Uh, okay, uh, I'm continuing to play our exhibition. Uh, when I asked him on the, about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. Interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes, leading to a sand covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into that dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the barrier. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should be with something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. Well, everybody knows. <laughs> the UK loves stealing from other countries. Shut up, you 
rats. You're not the fun rats. I don't know why they have that. Why would you? This is mine now. This is my buddy. He's my comfort toy. Good joy. How about you? Uh, I'm gonna play some. Come on, buddy. Onwards. Probably keep these open in case I come by this place later. So hey, I've been here. Oh, hello. I hereby offer my full attention and services to Alexander, Baron of Brennenberg. Brennenberg. This contract will reign for a total of three years when my freedom shall return to me. In addition, Alexander, Baron of Brennenberg, is to recommend my services to the Prussian Royal Court and within the sanctum to order the Black Eagle. May no man break the seal. Wilhelm, House of Garrick. Well. That's bad contract. <laughs> oh, that was sick. Okay. Um, I, you know, I, it's been, it was, it, it, I, I think, you know, I was actually going to let you go, right? I think you are even breaking my mind. So, onwards. My companion. Good job. Those are probably evil. Well. Protect me. Please. Or is that you? Is that your voice? <laughs> 7th May, 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it. And as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Yeah, fun. Attack of the books. Ah. Well, that was an urn.
Oh, shut up. You are not playing classical piano. I will not stand for it. Okay, there is something. Or lamp oil? His head is pounding and head ends are shaking. All is good on the health department. Oil. You just keep the lamp when it runs out, the lamp can no longer be used. Shame someone else has been picked up. Okay, so I got a lot of this. Let's go. What's it? This seems like a room ready for plot. Oh, wow. That. Man, you can really see where the... <laughs> it's almost like it's really there. I have a question, right? What if, if, if say, right? I left my companion behind. God damn it. Okay. Let's say uh, you are going through a tomb or you're discovering an ancient monument and you find some crazy old painting or piece of art or whatever, right? Something physical that you can just carry around. Is that immediately public domain? Like, say it was, like, created, you know, in the year 2008. It, you no, know, in the year 1,234, right? That's way, way before any copyright. Right? Maybe even before copyright exists in the first place. So what if... So, like, it does, does the copyright immediately become a public domain since it's immediately as it's, like, found out, you know? Like, oh, yeah, I know, you're free to go. Or is it whenever the person finds that? Oh. Get that out of the way. What? I can't... Oh. Can't play the music. Let's go to the thing clue where you put the sheet music. Yeah, I don't think that works. It's actually cool. You can't put the music down. Certainly interesting. You putty! Dun 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 Oh, 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 I'm sinking to my knees. 17th of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized... Oh, hey, was Miss Renz. <laughs> I was Welcome trapped. back. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's <gasps> when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry. 
but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. Oh. Wow. If you get close, you can barely even see the <laughs> textures glitching. Closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and Whoa. spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is oh, the great this is directional of audio. Being lifted, That's in my right ear now. Voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. Grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most I have a companion. Where is he? Oh, don't tell me abandon me. Oh no. Hello, companion. This is H Helmet Harold. Yes. Ah. Helmet Harold and me are best Master buddies. Isn't that right? Yes, I am your best friend. When the shadow arrives. It won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. <laughs> um... Let me set helmet here. Swing. That's uh, that's. Okay, we found something out. This this game takes place 1839. Possibly. Sorry. Just squeeze past you. Oh, jackpot! Don't ask me why the only thing in any of these chests is lamp oil and tinder and tinder boxes, but you know, it's fun. We're looking for a key. Champ on four dropped like it dropped twenty earlier. Oh jeez. Well. Oh, okay. Well, I'm trapped here now. Um. What the hell? Damn it, ha Harold. Or is it Harry? You're Harold. Helmet Harold. See anything? That's right, you're a helmet. You can't talk. Oh! It was breakable by hand. Gave me lies. Silly game. I see through all of your lies. <laughs> Where's no hell 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 uh, have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, Dan. Uh, maybe Helmet Harold can help us. Oh my god! Harold! You're a beast! Altstadt and Bannenberg Castle, 1801. Local folklore. Another region rich with lore is Altstadt, deep within the East Prussian woods. <sighs> For centuries, this paper has had a yawn. 
There have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbor, Castle Brennenburg. This quiet forest glad mound dressed with scattered lakes is as picturesque as can be, albeit the area is haunted. Solar ring. <laughs> Damn! Ha! <laughs> Play and laugh at the fool. I just sold in a ranked game. Ha <laughs> ha! Uh, asking local and you will hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travelers should indulge themselves in such conversations. They will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. All of them will have their own twist on the tables. On the tales, not tables. I'll turn tables. But there are some motifs that keep reappearing. I actually did really well. Uh, other than getting beaten up for being by. Um, but yeah. Uh, the gatherer story reaches all the way back to the time of the Three Years' War. It's so the soldiers are bad. They're doing it. Lost the color of quiz. We're afraid we have to roam the grounds. Bodies wrought by their tainted souls which have left them disfigured and empty of essence. Many have cited that over the years and years and described them as horror revenants. They move silently through the woods, shying away from any beholder. They are called gatherers, as they seem to follow any ambition. Oh, some ambition is still living creatures. It is their prey which can be heard struggling as like deep burlap sacks dragged behind them which reveal their presence. What dark scheme do they follow? Heinrich Norius Agrippa, well known. How many are these? Okay. What do you mean, Gabby? Yeah. Um. That, well, Christ, my phone fell. Uh, what I mean by getting beat up is that this guy was calling me the F-slur a bunch and had been. A bunch of his friends had been for the past... Oh, well, they were doing it last year as well. Um, they had been just tormenting me, being, you know, assholes, that kind of thing. Uh, and they had gotten even more and more worse, dumping, you know, food on me, etc. So, you know, one day, I'm, you know, I'm, I just finished my PE final. I, you know, got pretty good time on my mile. And he, uh, you know, he and his group of buddies call me the, the slur again. Uh, I, I like, I'm sitting down at this bench, and then another guy's about to sit down, and then, you know, I sit down first, just randomly, I'm not even trying. And the guy who was about to sit was like, oh, well, he sat there, I can't sit there. So, I'm like, okay, well, screw you then. <laughs> so I, uh, said, oh, wow, damn, I didn't think I was taking up this entire bench. And then, you know, this buddy's like, yeah. And then I say, you know, I didn't realize I was that fat. And he says, and then, uh... The guy who beat me up says, um, yeah, you know, says the word. Uh, and I s just sit there for a second, and then I look at him like, the hell you just call me? Because he had been doing this for a while, and I was just fed up with it. And then he, 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 he says it again, and I say, say that one more time. And I walk up and get close to him, and he says it again. And I say, one more thing, I fuck your mom. And then I go to slap him, and miss entirely, and then he... Which me a bunch of times of the uh, left, what, 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 yeah, the left side of my face, bashes my head against the bleachers, which were put away, so it was basically a metal wall, and then knocked me to the floor and kicked me a few times. Got a black eye, got a concussion, uh, had to go to the ER. Uh, but that was fun. I gotta get out of school early. And I missed uh, my my history and my P and my Spanish final, but I got to make those up. So yeah, that was fun. Yeah. Uh, all I know is that he got suspended from school one day, went on winter break. Well, he didn't even get suspended. He had a in-school suspension. Then he went to winter break and then just came back and nothing really happened to him, which is BS. Um, but yeah, that's that's what that's what happened with me. And that's kind of why I haven't really been streaming as much. Left side of my face is still very numb. Nerve damage. Problem of numbers society paid no, so he's mentioned in many records at the time. One day he went to investigate a burrow in the northwestern glades, only to never be seen again. Heinrich is known to have passed away in Grinnoble some ten years later. He dismissed the notion of ever very visiting Alstat, which makes you wonder what really happened. Who was the mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods? Baron Brandenburg lives with his life with him, unlike the other, no rumors are inherited alongside the child. Researching the history reveals little before the castle was consumed by fire in the late 16th century. It was rebuilt by Alexander and Noble from the Rhinelands, claiming the role as protector of the Prussian state. Alexander helped the region flourish and remain popular throughout his presumed lifetime. 
family has always been secretive when it comes to their lineage and heritage, but therefore the birth and death of Alexander's offspring have never been fully recorded. So the idea that the Baron was is in fact the one and the same who came from the West over 300 years ago. Lived through the time of occupation, joined the covered door of the Black Eagle alongside the great leaders of his country. That tells me next to nothing other than this place sucks. Come on, Helmet Herald. Let's go. Well, damn. If that's locked, what the hell am I doing here? <laughs> Supposed to be going. Where in the world? Where in? So, uh, let's find a new way out of this area. Oh no! I'm a herald! I'm probably missing like something super obvious. Chat is screaming at me, I swear. Chat isn't. <laughs> I don't have chat. Maybe it's under one of these books. There's nothing here, like what the what am I supposed to do? Why can't I just climb this? Okay, see helmet herald. Can I nope, okay. Those boards don't look like they're very structurally stable. I swear I can just if they say so. Walk through these boards for some reason. Miss, are you okay? I feel like every time I look at what you say, if I read it out loud, I'm going to get, like, <laughs> you know, flagged. <laughs> I'm going to tickle you. What? what? <laughs> Excuse me? No. No tickle the giraffe. Giraffes are an endangered species. You cannot do this. Maybe it's on like a bookshelf. This looks a place. Oh. What's that doing?
Hold the box. I did it. Oh. Me and my uncle had tickle time last night. Miss, do you need somebody to talk to, <laughs> man? I know a great psychologist. Skeleton key. Nope, that's the one. Cool. Wilhelm and his fools have endangered my research long enough. With their absent mind handling of the human vessels, the sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the forest and is killing my trusted ser trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail of the Redman herd. They lock up Wilhelm and his men up to avoid a further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off till the matter can be helped. Are the king's men will leave or they will starve. Whatever comes first, they can rough for all I care. Maybe I will feed them some wine. It would in a sense solve both of my problems. Psychoanalyst. Maybe it is time to get you a new analyst. Let's go. We'll be a, we're a force to be reckoned with. Who needed that unnamed saber guy? Right? Too small. Yeah, you're a big boy. You're a big beefy boy. Oh, you're open now. That's worrying. Do you have school tomorrow? Yes, yes, I have school Just Excuse me? Oh. Get back here. No! You monster! I have to leave Helmet Harold. Okay. Helmet Harold? I'll be right back. Put you in the nicest corner I can find. Uh, L, I don't. What do you mean you don't? Are you homeschooled? It's Friday tomorrow. Stan gave way to his tired body and he just fell from the camel's back. He felt the wind gently super Uh, no! Ow! It's becoming scary! Wait, I was having fun. It wasn't. A, it was. It wasn't scary. And now I see a guy move, and it's scary. Yeah. What? Okay. Does 
dunes were like waves and slurry sea, while the caravan moved, the land appeared motionless, but in camps, the hills moved. I remember why I don't like horror games. They don't make you feel good. No. Stop it. Where did the Baron go? Who cares? He left nothing up wine to last us a lifetime. Or at least until tomorrow. <laughs> Cooperate. Okay, that's one chemical. I have a weapon. Basically, guy experimenting on humans and locked him in the wine cellar. There's wine. Jesus Christ! Oh my God! Stop it! I'm gonna have nightmares tonight. All right. Excuse me? Can I? I can't. Box left. Keep it for a moment. What's happening? Oh, it feels like my chest is going to burst. Oh. My God, Wilhelm, do something! Except it. We're not getting out of here. Got three chemicals, I need one more. That's worry.
Harold? I no, I don't have a Harold. I had to leave him behind. I saw a man. Okay, I saw a figure. It's not in there anymore. that ball. I'm imagining figures right now. Okay. After enduring three days in Algiers, the sailor was finally ready to take him across the Mediterranean Sea to Gibraltar. Having reached British territory, it was just a matter of time. Missouri Cavalry plus three to see uh, head for London. you growing a <laughs> pulse Dang. I smell the desert and damp me us through the pieces they scream the dog I know there's no enemies here so I'm Is filled with acid. Yo, no way. God. Why is this open? This was not this open before, was it? Am I going crazy? I was crazy once. 
Do I just climb up? Do I just jump up? Kick back? Twirl around and spin? Do it all again. Jack, go! Jack, come on, come on. Do it, do it all. Oh! Okay. I get it. This is actually super cool. Oh my gosh. He even put it into place for me. But like in a way that could have been seen as like, oh, it's just... So, that's cool. <sighs> it's impossible to the commotion in the streets back for his attention as he opened the shutters. The French soldiers opened fire, and two young men fighting back. Their voices were silenced, and he's the gun spoke. Okay. Spur of blood is about to happen. Either. Oh. Achievement unlocked. Alchemist. Only 11.7% of people who bought this game, or got it, you know, it was on Game Pass, um, got that achievement. Which I take as an achievement. Like, I earned that. Except by the Casbah, okay. I earned that achievement. I'm the free thing. Is it? Oh. It sure is dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason yeah, no for shit. it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason for the darkness, that is? Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Dandel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. That's good. Second of June, 1839. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found. Okay, well. 
accidentally skipped through that. Why are you bottles shaky? I'm shaky. It's fine. Running out of lantern. This is bad. It's bad. Fuck. Off. So a lantern does not provide sanity light. 25th of June, 1839. I feel the need to continue this journal, even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, and texture, but ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care, and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapsed. Smith eased my mind okay, well, a bit, sorry. but I can't escape the feeling that these shards... What? My sanity should be getting better. Oh, wait, what are you... That is so cool. My heart got bigger. I don't think that's good. Going for it. Thank you everybody so much for watching. Uh, I, 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 I think this is a good point to stop, you know. <sighs> Straight for like 80 minutes. Oh, no, I'm doing it. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Fine. I. It is. 9.15 for me right now, so I need to go. <laughs> I want to be able to cool down and breathe and take a shower and <sighs> put Gibby on my phone for a little bit and then go to sleep. But, you know, thank you all so much for watching. I, uh, I'm very scared. 
And I will see you all uh, in the next one. Bye!